Exercise 5-2, creating a one variable data table. In this data table, we're going to see how profits are affected by different price points. First, we're going to enter the headings for our data table as follows. And then we're going to enter the different selling prices. And I'm going to type the first two price points, but for the rest, I'm just going to use Excel to fill it in for me automatically. Okay, now for profit for year zero, it will simply come from our model, C22. And I can simply copy that formula to year one and year two. Okay, and now we're ready to build our data table. Our data table will simply take these different selling prices, substitute these prices into the selling price in the model, and tell us what the profit would be for year zero, year one, and year two. So I'm going to select the area that contains the data table. I'm going to click data, what if analysis, data table. And I'm going to enter C10 in the column input cell because C10 is where I want to enter the different selling prices and they happen to be along the column of the data table. So we go to the column input cell and I click OK and the profits have just been filled in. And if you'll notice the profits for the selling price of $150 matches what we have in our model because we currently have $150 as our assumption. And that's our one variable data table.